So, and overall, I basically give the movie about a D minus. After after I got over the you know upsetness of it being a not good horror film, and I started realizing it, the rest of it's gonna be a horror comedy. There were some funny parts to it. There was. Yeah, like I'm, I'm gonna say like if if you're looking for a horror film, a good zombie horror film, I'm gonna go I'm gonna go with a D. But if you want a horror comedy, it's a B plus. It's a B plus for a horror comedy. Yeah. Because uh, there was definitely some funny parts. Like, um, this one part. Here, watch this. Now, he's about to throw a grenade at the door. Grenades don't do this. What? What? Yeah, when the door explodes and you're about uh, this far apart from the door when the grenade goes off, there's shrapnel that's coming at you. No, this guy's just standing there burnt, looking at it like, Duh. Like, Looks to his what friends. Just, what just happened? Right. What Looks just to happened? His friends huh? and like, huh? Like, oh, okay. Let's shoot. Duh, duh, duh. What the hell was that? What the hell was that? You know? And ex- <laughs> my favorite, my funny part is, my favorite part is at the very end when the older man, he, he you know, there's a duel. You know, he, he fights. He, he gets shot a couple times, and his daughter, she got bit by a zombie, and he comes out. I mean, he's, he's laying on the ground, and then they, then they come back, and uh, they're walking through the woods, they're about to leave, and then the daughter's like, wait, and he comes out of those, he's like, boom, I shoot, uh, I'm okay, and just fucking bugs out, and leaves, I'm like, what? He just comes out, he's like, I shot my daughter, and then walks away. Yeah, I was like, what? <laughs> How stupid was that? Yeah, and also at the end, he had a zombie... And then the zombie started. Well, actually, we had to go and bleep what he just said because we don't want to ruin anything for any real diehard fans who want to go out there and pay $10 for a crappy-ass movie. I just ruined it for you. Just accept it. Yeah, that's why I went and bleeped it out, just to be sure. But, you know what? I actually have to say the most funny thing that I actually found throughout the entire movie, this movie was basically dealt with about an island that's somewhere off Delaware. And apparently on this island that's near Delaware... It's Plum they, Island. Basically, they all speak Irish. Yeah, it's two Irish families. Near Delaware. In Plum Island. Yeah. Makes Plum. sense to me! Plum Island. Yeah, it's a Plum Island. I don't know about all that, but it's called Plum Island. Yeah. Full of Irish. Yeah, that's what I don't get. Should probably do some research and see if only two Irish families live on Plum Island, yeah. or if a Plum Island even exists. Very true. Which I don't really know, so I probably sound really ignorant right now. But who knows? <laughs> yeah, that was basically the only funny thing throughout the whole thing for me. Uh, but like we said, it's basically not a good movie. It sucked. Uh, it's not really worth going out to the theaters to go and watch it. Uh, the only reason why we were able to go and really view it is because they stuck it on pay-per-view. So you could be able to view it before his theaters. We thought, hey, that'd be great. But then... We saved ten bucks. Yeah, at least... Well, actually, no. We actually saved more with... Uh, for, because of Miss Nerf Needles. True. Miss Nerf Needles did watch it with us, but she couldn't be here today. Right. Woman things. Yeah, you know. But, um... <laughs> yeah, she had to go shopping. Yeah. You know how she that is. Mm-hmm. Some more, some new combat boots. Yeah. Fucking Russians. Alright. Oh, great. Sounds like the trucks are starting up. So, anyway, folks, we're going to go ahead and get ready to take off because we have to go to our next review area. Um, bunch of, a bunch of different zombie films. Yeah, we're basically going to be doing the whole George Romero's week. So, uh, anyway, this is Dr. Stavers. Certain slice. And we'll go and catch you guys at the reviews. Peace. Just this once, just for you, then never again. I finally found a way out. They pulled me back into black sand, emphatic infractions.